Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, I'm Victoria, and today we are going to be going on a squish hunt at Vegas. So this is actually some older footage from when I was at Vegas. Uh, so, you know, obviously now I'm at home, I am in California, but yeah, so I just had some videos of squish hunting from Smith's, Walgreens, and Walmart, and maybe a few other places, I believe, but yeah, so... You guys comment down below and guess if it was a success or a fail and let's see who gets it right i will see you guys at the first store okay guys so first i went to i believe that this is tj maxx or home goods i honestly can't tell from the inside anymore because as i said this is older footage and i'm just now doing a voiceover um but the first thing i saw was this i believe her name is harmony or something it's like the pink little birdie stack i actually do have this one but i only have it in a defect at home uh, I actually really like the defect one. It's so cute. It's like has flopping arms. If you haven't seen that video already, the arms are like upside down. Anyways, one of them is sewn upside down. So that's pretty cool. Then there were tons of imposters, you guys, and uh, some unicorns as always. I saw this one at Five Below the other day, but uh, yeah, we'll skip on the unicorns. There was another one over there. And then just more imposters down here. I mean, look at all this narwhal these dinosaurs these pigs but they're not squishmallows they're just i don't even know what the brand is but they're just not okay they're not it then uh we saw some imposters of the squishmallow backpacks and then we found the real squishmallow backpacks yay okay so this is i believe her name is tamara she like has like a really galaxy tie-dye um, it was $16, which is not too bad, so if you find the Monica backpack here, that would be good, but this is the newer squad of the backpacks, uh, I don't even know why I just, like, open it, and, like, of course it's a backpack, I don't even know why I was questioning that, uh, but, yeah, so that is pretty much all that they had, then I checked over here, and they had some of the Squishmallow mystery bags over here, as you can see, these were, like, I believe 8 inch or something, I am not sure, but basically, yeah, they had the mystery bags. Nobody was buying them, of course. I remember these from such a long time ago from Five Below. And then they had these little Squishville sets, which were so cute. But, like, they didn't have the ones that I wanted. They didn't have the one with the little octopus or the one with the little frog. But they were only $4.99. And, you guys, at Party City, they're, like, $15 for that. Because, yes, I found them at Party City, and they're $15. Anyway, so we went to this Walmart. As you guys may know, my Walmart never has anything. And this Walmart actually had a lot of stuff. Nothing really good, but they had a lot. And compared to my Walmart, I'd say that that's pretty good. So we found Elsa over here. There were tons of Elsas. And this is her squad with Olaf and Anna. And I forgot the little deer's name. Uh, but then we also found Paco, which was really random. And I don't think he had a tag, did he? I don't know. Uh, and then we saw Anna... She's super cute, uh, but wouldn't ever get her, ever. But yeah, that's pretty much all that they had. Just tons of the Disney ones and Paco, which is very random. But yeah, I also, oh my god, the guy here. So there's these like Walgreens Haley clips and stuff. And the guy that works here said that they got them like a week ago and we missed out on it. So that's really sad. Um... I wish I could find them because Haley Clip is so adorable and I need her. Like, we asked him to check the boxes and he was like, there's no boxes with Squishmallows, you guys. And I'm like, okay, fine. Uh, but then we went to this aisle and this aisle had some stuff. Like, it had this Squishmallow tag in this aisle. And there was another Lonely Paco and, oh, 12-inch Heather. Two 12-inch Heathers. Uh, let's see what this squad is. So the Paco squad has Babs in it and all, ki all kinds of birds. And then this squad had, who is this? It had the little axolotl, oh my god, and the cow, oh my god, I want the axolotl and the cow. Now I'm sad, okay. On to the next store, now we are gonna go to Walgreens, and let's hope that the Vegas Walgreens gives us some more luck, uh, because our Walgreens has not been very good lately, okay? So let's walk in and see what we could find. There's me, like throwing away my drink you guys i got this okay if you guys have never tried the smooth talking mango from jamba juice it is so good you guys you have to try it because it is so underrated like nobody talks about it but it's delicious it's like probably healthy because it tastes kind of healthy but like a good healthy i don't know but it's amazing anyways so we did not find too much over here but well i mean nothing too good i mean we did find a lot of these weird 16 inches, as always, uh, like this 
whatever this is, this iguana type of thing. Oh, we did find Tinkerbell, I remember, which is a new one, but nothing that we wanted. And then more Elsas, like, isn't this enough Elsas for the day? But yeah, more Elsas and Olafs. Anyways, then we saw this weird alien thingy, which literally looks like the Demogorgon. Anyways, uh, this chick was kind of cute, but it was an 8-inch, and I don't need 8 inches, plus I don't have room for that, so I didn't end up getting it. And then we saw Ariel. She's interesting, okay? I like... It's kind of weird how they make the eyes, okay? There's nothing I like. It's just weird how they make the eyes. So, yeah. Then we thought we spotted something down there, but it was just another Elsa. And this, which I thought was... uh vector from despicable me for some reason but no it's from incredible and i've never seen incredible i don't think so yeah at least i think it's uh from incredible anyways from that movie that i've never seen so i'm not really sure but yeah so there was nothing that we were really looking for here just tons of disney stuff and the stuff that we always find now the next store is pretty cool because this store is called Smith's, and I actually do not have this where I live, so it's basically like Kroger, it's basically like a Kroger, ah, I can't even talk, a Kroger affiliate, so they had um, some stuff over here, we saw this Cushmola box, and I got really excited, because I was like, okay, maybe it'll have some different stuff, since we're in Nevada now, uh, but it didn't, it was like pretty much the same stuff, uh, they were actually on sale for only $14 now, I'm not sure what the original price is though, uh, but yeah, so then we found this eggplant, which I actually got in the clip, like, a long time ago. I really wanted Ludwig, uh, but I've seen him a couple times, actually, in the 12-inch at my Ralph's, but I didn't get him because it's a little too big. Like, I want, like, a 5-inch or an 8-inch. I still don't have Ludwig, by the way, so I need Ludwig. And then I saw this squad, which I've already found and made a video about, uh, at my Kroger, but yeah, so nothing special there. They also didn't have the mushroom. But I did see the little Wilfred, and then we have Orin the Orange, and this shell over here. I'm not sure why I keep on finding that, but I do. Uh, I believe that it used to be in Australia. It used to be, like, an Australian exclusive, and now it's not. Uh, but then there was this weird fox, and that is basically it. Like, I was digging to find something new, but it was just the same stuff. Uh, there's Babs. I did get the Babs a while ago when I did find this squad. And then there was another side to the box. So I checked in there, and it was pretty much the same stuff. Just, you know, they didn't have the Brina or anything. You guys, Celestina is still so pretty. Like, I love her colors and everything. And I just don't know why I don't get her, but, like, I didn't get her. So, yeah. This video could have had a haul, but we didn't get her. But it's okay. Then we saw more dragons over here, this, like, blue triceratops dragon thingy, and then this Vicky the fox. I believe that that one's name is Vicky, which is pretty cool because that's my name. Well, not my full name. My full name is Victoria, but still, you know, it still counts. Anyways, that is it, and I will see you guys back home. Okay, hey guys, so we did not find much in Vegas, uh, but as you saw, it was pretty much a fail. I didn't end up buying anything, of course, because there was nothing good to buy. I mean, everything, there was nothing really that I was interested in. But yeah, that is it for today, and before we leave, make sure to like, subscribe, and smash the notification bell, so you're notified every time we have a brand new video, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!